Hello and welcome to Telecom TV. My name is Martin Warwick and I'm talking with Sawa Raza, who is the Vice President Product Management NFV at Hewlett Packard Enterprise. Sawa, good to see you again and thanks for talking to us. Thank you for having me. Can you tell me what the NFV system itself consists of? The NFE system is meant to provide service providers with a turnkey approach to deploying uh, virtualized network functions. Uh, and it comes in uh, various kits. Uh, start off with a starter kit that provides the requisite compute, storage, networking resources, uh, as well as a virtual infrastructure manager, which is the HPE, HPE Helion OpenStack Carrier Grade 2.0 product. Uh, as well as the necessary physical infrastructure manager products, uh, HP One OneView, HP IMC, uh, IMC and HPE uh, CMC. All of these are bundled together, integrated, and uh, provided as an integrated system that allows providers to simply take the system, start onboarding applications, and get into production without having to mix and match. Uh, components and, and manage their, their life cycles. Now, the system comes in various forms. You start off with the starter kit, and the starter kit itself comes in rack mount and, uh, and chassis-based options. Uh, the, those are uh, blade systems. You can also have, uh, in addition to that, additional compute capacity by way of adding a compute kit, additional storage capacity by means of adding a storage kit, and should you need to expand the control plane capacity, it comes with a modular control plane kit as well. So all these pieces put together uh, along with our factory integration service, the NFE system ships out the door, out of the factory, pre-cabled, pre-integrated, ready to go into production. Thank you, that explains the background to it very well. Thanks for that. Now let's have a look at NFE system 1.2. What's new about it? NFV System 1.2 ships with the newest version of HPE Helion OpenStack uh, Carrier Grade, which is version 2.0. Uh, uh, this new version of software packs a lot of new features, a lot of new performance enhancements, uh, as well as much more scalability than the previous version. Um, we've also made uh, some, some changes uh, with respect to uh, reducing our dependency on third-party components in the system. So, for example, we now use all open source databases as well as open source hypervisors uh, for the associated management products, uh, which really gives us this ability to have a, a, a single vendor, uh, open standards, open source based solution. We've made uh, several enhancements to the system software. So lifecycle management has gotten better, logging has gotten a lot better. Uh, and uh, you know we continue to, to make improvements to pretty much every aspect of the system with every release. Uh, Sawa Raza, thank you very much indeed. Thank you so much.